Porsche GT3 Cup Challenge Middle East enters the crucial stage of the season with round four at the LaSalle International Circuit in Qatar. The first night race marks the second half of the series with the driver's title still up for grabs amongst the top five. Defending champion Zaid Ashkanani posts a blistering time in qualifying on the technically challenging track, putting him on pole position. The fastest lap I ever done, so yeah, I'm happy with that. Clement Schmidt of Al Nabuda Racing has to be content with the second position on the grid. Fahad Al Ghosaibi from Saudi Arabia starts from third. At the start, Schmidt tries to get the better of Ashkanani in the first corner, but the Kuwaiti manages to hold off the challenge. Hasha Al Maktoum and Saeed Al Mahairi of the Skydive Dubai Falcons get off to a great start and overtake Saudi's Banda Al Asai to claim fifth and sixth position. Al Maktoum tries to overtake Charlie Freens from the Netherlands. I tried to dive them, uh, into Charlie and, and we have uh, contact. The cars collide, forcing Freens off the track. I, I went off, off track. Ahmad Al Hati of Al Nabudu Racing benefits from the battle in front of him and claims fourth position. Shortly after, Al Hati loses two positions to Banda Al Asayi and Riyad Rafi of Team Bahrain. I was surprised to find myself in the top four. Car damage from the collision in lap one forces Hasha Al Maktoum to retire halfway through the race. I don't want to create bigger problems for the car, so I just managed to stop. As the top three manage to build a comfortable gap between them and the rest of the pack, Charlie Freens works his way up the field. I had to do a comeback because I was totally in the last position. The first guy I needed need to, to overtake was my father, but he was very kind to me and he, he let me pass. That was the beginning of a very hard fight against uh, Ahmed Al Hati because he's a very good defender. It was, an, it was a good fighter. Even my nose, his nose, into certain corners and kept the pressure on us for the whole race. In the closing stages, he manages to push past Al Hati to finish in sixth position. He was slightly quicker and uh, managed, uh, managed to pass me. Zaid Ashkanani proves to be unbeatable today, celebrating a brilliant start to finish victory. I tried my best, I built the gap, and yeah, just control the race. Fantastic! Clement Schmidt comes in second. Said was untouchable today. We finished second, it's, it's okay. Fahad Al Ghosaibi claims his second podium finish in a row with a third place. I was pushing the car right from the beginning and managed to stay in third place. Luckily, it was a smooth race. An exciting and nail biting race day comes to an end with the top three on the podium. Stay tuned for race two of round four of the Porsche GT3 Cup Challenge Middle East at the LaSalle International Circuit.